If you're brave like our Bob Van Dillen, you can do underground caving in Tennessee and try to conquer the lemon squeezer. Today we are spelunking or caving in Coverlink Caverns, Tennessee. My guide Robbie and I are heading 300 feet underground into one of the largest cave systems in the U.S. I'm climbing up and down boulders and squeezing through some extremely tight passages. So how many miles of cave is there right here? We have a little over 27 mapped miles of cave. There's a lot of things we have to worry about when we're traversing the ground cover. It takes a lot of upper body strength. Uh, you know, you just have to kind of step back, take a look at where you're headed, plan your route, and then start maneuvering up the boulders, you know, and using your upper body to pull yourself up. We're about halfway through, but the hardest part is yet to come. We've been through a couple of tight squeezes already. What do we have to look forward to? Oh, well, just ahead we have the lemon squeezer. Lemon squeezer? Yeah. I'm inside the lemon squeezer, and it's getting really uncomfortable. It's like 12 inches high, so you can imagine crawling through your air duct. Jeez. The lower you go, the harder it is. I am literally dragging my body across this muddy floor right now. It is a tough passage to get through, but once you break open, there's this whole new room. It's gigantic. This might be one of the coolest things I've ever done. Bob Van Dillen conquering spelunking. Gotta love it, Robin. He said that stalagmite slide there. He had to dodge those things. It was like playing Russian roulette. <laughs> and in the end, it felt like he was being birthed from the earth. Is that <laughs> what, what he said? said? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's hysterical. <laughs> Leave it to Bob, right? Oh, yeah. All right. For